welcome back. Today's video, I'm going to be making floral arrangements and I'm going to be using items that were inexpensive, but I'm going to make the arrangements look expensive. I'm also going to be sharing with you some really cool finds that I found at Dollar General and the Dollar Tree. So let's get started. <laughs> week and I was in there to get some cleaning supplies and just some odds and ends and when I walked in there was this beautiful spring table of all of these spring accessories and I was like where am I <laughs> check out their home accessory section they're stepping it up I'm going to be showing you some things that I found there I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing with them yet but I'm sure they'll be in upcoming videos but I was like so excited I love finding things that aren't expensive but I can kind of zhuzh them up a little bit and make them look more expensive and high-end so first, let me just show you some of the things that I did find at the Dollar General. So I found this basket. It was $5. You can use it for silverware. You can really use it for anything. I might e even end up doing a little flower arrangement. I'm not sure yet. So I need to think on that. I also found these cute jars that they come with chalk and they come in two different sizes. I thought they would be really cute for Easter to put some jelly beans and maybe some Easter candy in them, um, but great find. I also found these. There's some really cool things that you can do with pieces like this. They don't have to be used as plate chargers. They can be used as other things as well. And I'm still thinking of a few ideas. I have a couple in mind. I'll probably put them in one of my future videos. This is just like an ar architectural piece on a stand. You guys know how I am with architectural pieces. But this was $8, but I just happened to be at the right place at the right time uh, when I walked into that Dollar General because they were having a 70% off sale on all of their home goods and accessories that day only. So this was $8 and I got it for 70% off of that crazy so I don't know if I like the color but it's totally worth changing I'm sure I'm gonna manipulate it in some kind of way to make it fit my decor you know that you can do stuff like this I mean there's there's all kinds of cool things you can do with these pieces that are not expensive I'm so excited this also came from the Dollar General and it was only six dollars and it's a really pretty like per periwinkle blue and I thought it would be really pretty with some lavender in it so I'm going to be making an arrangement with this as well I just had to share with you my favorite hand soap 
It is by Latasse, and I will put it in the description box below. But this stuff is amazing. The bottles are beautiful. They look hand-painted, and they're really beachy and springy and summery. And this fragrance in particular, I don't know how they did it, but they managed to take the beach and put it in this bottle. How did they manage to put the beach in this bottle? It smells just like it and it makes me happy. I'm in love with it and I know you'll love it. If you love the beach and everything about it, this is an amazing fragrance. And since these bottles are so beautiful, I was so happy to see that they come in refills. And of course my beach is almost out, um, but it also comes in Sweet Orange, which is a great fragrance as well, but the beach is my absolute favorite. I will put the link in the description box below, and I hope you like it as much as I do. These bottles are beautiful, and the fragrance is even better. I love it. Oh, it smells so good. This flower arrangement, I'm going to start with this piece. This is a galvanized piece that I got from the Dollar Tree. And I thought it was so cute. These are like really in right now. And I don't know if you can see it. It says flowers and garden, really cute. I'm going to put some floral foam in the bottom. I'm not gonna glue this floral foam in because I like to change things a lot, especially with the seasons. So I don't want this to be permanently in there. So I'm gonna take some bags and just kind of stuff it in the nooks and crannies and help that floral foam kind of hang in there. So you can see that it's just kind of stuck in there. I like putting greenery in first because it almost acts like a filler. Also from the Dollar Tree. Also got these day lilies. These remind me of springtime and Easter time. So I'm just going to put a few here and there. And I'm just going to place them one by one. And I think that's what really helps a flower arrangement look more expensive is if you do them individually. just kind of fill in the gaps. I think I'm gonna add a couple of the white lavender and maybe some of these, just a couple. this 
right over by my sink. This is another piece that I got from the Dollar General and it was only $10. So one of my favorite things is to find an arrangement and just pep it up, add some greenery, add some more things to the arrangement to make it look more high end and expensive. I think this is perfect. I absolutely love this color. I love the basket and the moss is just the perfect touch to bring it all together. So the next spring arrangement I'm going to be doing is with lavender and I'm going to be using this vase that I got from the Dollar General. Again, it was $6. I love the periwinkle color and I love the color of lavender. So this is gonna be really simple. I'm just taking this and I'm taking a bunch of the lavender that I got from the Dollar Tree and I am just going to cut off the stickers and just place them in this vase. And I guess I probably should have taken the stickers off first, but I was just so excited with all of these beautiful spring finds that I just couldn't help myself. I had to start my video as soon as I got home. <laughs> you know what? I want these to stand up just a little bit higher, so. So I'm going to just take, I'll probably need more than that. Oh, uh, let's see what that looks like. I think that's perfect. Oh, how pretty is that? Now that makes me happy. Those colors make me happy. I just gotta find the perfect place to put this. I think this one is my favorite. It just really speaks to my soul and it makes my heart happy. Which one do you like the best? Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. And if you're new here and you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so because it really helps me out. If you like this video, you might just like this one as well. Thank you so much. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.